welcome back in today's video i am going to show you the vendor ledger management system which is the upgraded version of our previous video so what we changed what we made have a change we added our uh, email functionalities uh, when you add a new vendor uh, the vendor will receive a email when you add a transaction for a particular vendor uh, the transactions will uh, uh, email also be received to your vendor and when you send statement to your uh, vendor they will also go to a email so what is this so uh, let we have a, let we take step by step let we see step by step of this web app so here first of all uh, this is our main page in our main page uh, you will see select a vendor for transactions so all the vendors available in this uh, sheet the in this customer sheet so you can see here all the vendors so right now uh, all you will see that uh, all the vendors in a drop down with their particular vendors id so you can see here if i select this vendor so you will see the data is loading and i am able to see only that particular vendors transactions and if i want to add a transactions for this x y z z traders i simply click on the add uh, transactions and uh, here i will select the date and the bill and the amount so you will see uh, the bill is the credit and the payment is the debit okay so bill is the credit so if i enter uh, the 1500 and particular item is uh defi so when i click on the add so you will see that ledger entry added successfully and you can also see in our data table and uh, here the thing is that the latest date will be showing on the first and the previous past date will be showing on the below note that the latest data showing on the end and the previous showing on the end so here this is the thing uh, you will see the latest data will show on the top and if you want to make a print for this uh, transactions for a, for make a, a print for this vendor's transaction so simply click on the print and here you will go to a print like that and also if you want to download a pdf so you can simply download the pdf okay so when i added a bill for xyzz so you can see here the bill amount email will also be received to xyz uh, in my end i use the same email id for the all so that's why i will receive the emails on the on my own email okay so again i will show you uh, if i will add a transactions of 21 and uh, here the payment and the 600 and the d4 and when i click on the add so you can see here ledger add data into successfully added and also i will receive a payment from this xyzz traders because right now i select the debit so debit means i receive a payment from the customer so you will see uh, the uh, vendors also receive the email for the updation in the database and also you can download the excel file you can copy this data and send to your uh, loved ones for example like that you can also send the transactions uh, you can simply make a copy you will as you also know very well so here you will uh, also you can search the data from the here okay so uh right below you will see the vendor list what is the vendor list vendor list is that all the vendors have current balances for example this is the vendor list and you can see here the serial number the vendor name vendor number what is the vendor number this is the vendor number this is the vendor name now it will show uh now it will show the balances how the balances will be shown it will go to the ledger web app and uh, perform the calculations and generate the final amount of that person so and will show it here okay so this is a vendor list with their balances for example abc is now in minus nine uh, minus this data and ghi consulting vendor number six will be the nine thousand so if you want edit for example uh, xyzz i will if you want to search 
x y z z so you can see x y z z is here and if you want to edit this data you simply click on the edit icon and simply remove one z from here and click on the save changes and when you click on the save changes so you can see here the data is successfully updated in our database and if you want to delete a particle for example i want to delete this i simply need to click on the delete and click on the yes delete it so when i click on the date the vendor is successfully deleted so here abc are uh, the pqr industries i have three transactions with this uh, vendor with this business so you can see here all the transactions from the march 12 march 20 and the march october 20 24 so you can uh, uh, so if i want to send a statement to that customer so what is pq so pqr industries when i click on the email so you can see here you will able to send all the statements mean what's the all the statement means uh matlab ye hai ye jitni bhi statement this is all the statements of this particular and if you want to send all the statements you simply go here click on this email icon and click on the send statement when you click on the send statement so you will see a uh, email your account statement and you will see all the statements uh with uh with uh with us of that vendor of this vendor of mine okay so my english is not well i am just trying to make my videos on my subscribers request in english language okay so if you want to send a transaction statements or statement of a particular date you simply press on that and click on customize date range when you click on the customize date range so you can select here uh from october and october 31 and when you click on the send statement you will see the statement sent successfully and in the email you will see only one transaction found for this particular customers with me okay so this is the system we do and uh, uh you can also delete this vendor again and uh, here if you uh, uh reset the searches you can also uh sorting your data in ascending or descending way so you can see here right now in descending and uh, uh, now, uh, now it will be shown in a balance for example the highest balance lowest lowest and again so uh, if you want to show that uh, filters the vendors balance less than equals to zero so you can see here this also so if you want to add a new vendor for example uh, i will add a hassan tech uh, enter a uh, phone number also email id i will use the same which is i currently log in so you will see what happens if i add a vendor uh it's a a whole wholesale accessories okay address is hhs so when i click on the add vendor so you can see here the vendor is added successfully so here uh when i select hassan h a double s so you can see here hassan tech is here right now and on the email id i will check welcome to our vendor portal so you can see here the hassan tech receive a email so uh, that we are registered you in our vendor portal so if i made a transactions for this hassan and simply made a transactions on 20 and make a bill payment of 50 500 rupees of h5 of h5 so when i click on the h5 and when i click on the add so you can see here the data is successfully added for the hassan tech and you will uh, the hassan tech also got a email that this ad data will be added in their databases so if you click on the show all vendors so you can see here all wanted balances so vendor name the vendor number and the vendor balances for example i uh, Hassan tech so you can see here Hassan balance is 500 so if I uh, make this for example uh, I wanna uh, the Hassan paid me so I will payment are uh, done so 500 also g4 and uh, the g4 also you can see here when I click on the add so the data is successfully added and also you can see here the balance is zero because 500 is the credit now i will debit it the 500 and when i click on the show all vendors so you can see here the hassan is set to be h a double s the hassan is because this is now zero 
we can we are not uh, going to conduct any money from that so here we cannot see this data from here of that particular transaction okay so right now this is our web app of customer ledger vendor ledger management system with crud functionalities edit functionality edit functionality delete functionality send statement to email of all statement and customized date statements and also you can see we can download the system is a copy uh, excel files excel uh, pdf and the print also so this is this is our vendor management web app hope you like it uh, my english is not well i am just trying to make my videos to make you understand what i'm trying to say to all of you so uh with the passage of time my english is going to be well so we hope we can do very very great things in future so take care allah